Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to flash your new RC, or just update your old version of Express LRS. There is an online flasher, which I will link in the video's description, but I prefer to download the program to my PC. So, start by searching Express LRS Configurator. You want to go here, and then click on the link here. Download the version for your computer and install it. If you're already stuck, it tells you what you need here. Once installed, open it up, and the top option should be the latest release. Next, come down to Device Category and type in the brand of your remote. I'm using the Jumper T15, so when I type Jumper, I get these options pop up. And I'm going to select the 2.4 option, because I'm updating the 2.4 GHz, not the 900 MHz. Next, choose your remote, so I'm going to select the T15. You want to select the pass-through option. It's not always necessary to download the Lua script, but I'm going to suggest you do. Save the file to your computer. Turn on the remote and plug it into the PC via a USB. Use the scroll wheel to select USB storage option. Now, go to My PC. The remote will show up as a USB drive. Open the drive and go to Scripts and then Tools. Put the new Lua script in here and it will overwrite the old one. Unplug the remote and turn it off. If you're in the UK or Europe, you need to select the Listen Before Talk option. This has reduced power required by law. You can use the standard option, which will give you a stronger signal, but that's on you and I don't recommend it. For other countries like USA, definitely use the standard option. Next, put in your Wi-Fi name and password and I recommend you use a binding phrase. If you don't have one, choose one now. This is basically a password which you use on all your drones and remotes. Once done, whenever you turn on a remote and drone, they will automatically bind for you. Now, turn on your remote and plug it into the PC, but this time, choose the USB serial option. Press the flash button and your remote will update. If you've not done it before, it will take a while, but it will be faster the next time you update. 